Exactly how did they use this 44 meter long craft as a crane? Here is Istvan Shurush's theory. A rising and dipping motion was used to raise the building blocks, which was facilitated by a large group of men moving back and forth along the deck. In the first phase, the men made their way to the forward part of the craft. This caused it to dip and the prow to settle deeper in the water. In this phase, the load was attached to the forward part of the ship. As the men made their way aft, the prow raised together with its load. The stone building block was then lowered by reversing the process.